You see that? We have puddles of water, wet grass all over, and sky is looking so meh. 12 30 a.m. and it starts to rain. 5 30 a.m. and it is still seriously pouring. Usually, in situations like this, I wouldn't really want to go and fly because you do not want to crash your drone and end up in a puddle. But because today is a special occasion for me, I'm meeting up with a new DJI FPV pilot. He should be coming by anytime now. Yes, Daniel. Hey, hello. What's up? <laughs> so we have been talking a lot about anything and everything. We even stopped by to where was the place just now? Uh, Sleta. Sleta Reservoir. Sleta Reservoir. Of all things, I, I had intent for today's episode to be talking about FPV. So what is FPV about? Um, I, I'll be going direct into it, which is about drone FPV, not about any other type of FPV. FPV just basically just means um, first person view right some people may call it otherwise but that's how i knew it backstory about this fpv and why is it so exciting as a drone pilot we all grew up with the the the, the phantom one and twos where the drones had cameras yes obviously it was a flying camera that's how drones came about cinematic cameras then it became commercialized that anybody can own so how people fly drones is typically is called line of sight like you you keep the view of the drone in your line of sight but with flying line of sight there is always the limitation if yes you have the view of what the drone sees um, from the attachment which is normally you would attach your screen or you would attach your phone to get a view of what the drone sees but there is still some limitation there because you wouldn't really feel like you're flying that drone so what is the most attractive part about FPV drones is the fact that you will get a chance to immerse yourselves in the flight where FPV pilots will be wearing goggles and so with the goggles on that's where you will actually be immersed in that flight and you'll be practically what we'll, we'll call piloting the drone and that opens up a lot of avenues, okay? Having the freedom to open up um, where we call acro mode, raid modes. Um, in the DJI FPV, it is called manual mode. You can really just send it, right? You can really just send your drone anywhere you want. Any, any nook and cranny that you think that you, uh, I want to do a, 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 a gap, a knife edge through this space, uh, you just send it, right? Within regulation. Of course. Within regulations, <laughs> please obey your local laws. Don't talk about me getting in trouble, but it's about the community. We're here to build the FPV community bigger. Nobody wants to get our hobby affected, okay, in a negative way. If you're new or uh, getting into FPV, fly within your, your, your drone laws and that's that's a good start. Lah. That's what I'd say. You, you could really just get off fine with get off. Is that a word? You oh, could just move say, along. <laughs> you could just move along and and fly line of sight uh, with your drone. But what FPV will give you is that immersive feeling, yeah, like yeah. you're flying. Wow, you you're flying. Like you're literally you're, flying. You're literally flying. Yes, and mm. like if you've ever looked up at the skies and wow. The, those birds are really having a hell of a time, uh, right? Or like you, you've been in the sky. I was sharing about how I fell in love with the skies is because I actually, um, in my service, I had to do sky sky dives uh, in simpler in simpler words, right? That made me fell in love with the skies. Uh, I leave that for a different topic totally, but <laughs> the, the 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 point here is about FPV drones are and will be the most immersive kind of. Um, drone piloting you will ever experience. If anybody has the interest to go into FPV, um, just hold on because I'll be 
uh, getting to a separate topic, a separate episode totally, where I'll mention to you more about where you can start off with drones, all right? Yeah, so actually we are already here. Here is Bishan Park. It's, it, it is a fly zone, but um, I think there's some concern, right? Uh, the birds. Yeah, there were... There were bird guys here. There are what, kite what? people uh, here as well. Yeah, there, were, there are people now flying kites and they have their parrots or macaws. Oh, I don't know what yeah, bird it is. Macaws, yeah. yeah. Um, we, as what, as when we started off this topic, we do not want to be killing any birds. Yeah. <laughs> especially when they cost $8,000, right? No I mean, more. besides the fact that, come on. Uh, someone's yeah, pet. It's, someone, it's somebody's loved one. Yeah, right? yeah. So, you want to be responsible, right? You get my point. Okay, I'm gonna wrap it up right here. Dan and I are gonna go and recce this place and find a better spot so we don't injure any soft targets right in the sky. Uh, yeah. Anyways, if you've liked this episode, don't give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you've not already. Leave me a comment. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Pilots, as always, I'll see you in the skies. Peace.